Well, we have to say a very big thank you to Audrey. Obviously, she's mm. going through an incredibly difficult time and then to invite us along to help others who may be experiencing what she is. But we have heard uh, from Audrey. We know that Thomas is, is settled in. Which is good news, isn't it? Mm. But what was comforting, as you said, that it was at the end of the film, is that, you know, she had Hannah to guide yes. her and to help her. Yes. But that's not the same in every case, is there? There is no person like Hannah no, to give you that unfortunately, advice. No, unfortunately, I mean, we've said several times when we, you know, we were spending the time with Audrey, we wish we could clone Hannah. Hannah because mm. it was such an important service mm. there is no sort of umbrella organization that does that everywhere uh, over the country but there's no coordinated network but there are charities who do who have Hannah's if you like and mm -hmm. um, it's a shame there aren't more of them because mm. it's it's absolutely invaluable yeah now I mean the funding is a, is a huge issue for anybody yes. who's yes. looking into this Thomas's care is paid for so who is entitled to that well, the first threshold um, that we have to look at is just above £14,000, 14250 If your assets and capital fall below this, then the local authority will fund your social care as opposed to nursing care. Right. Now, um, above that, we go to just over £23,000, mm -hmm. and in between that, you um, get some hope, help from your local authority, and there are some instances where local authorities will let you defer payment for, say, 12 weeks, or until you have paid off... Uh, sold your, you sold your home house and if you've got assets pay it and, back yeah. if you've got assets to pay it back um, above that 23,250 essentially financially you know you are on your own uh, and that's the bracket that most people um, fall into at yeah. the moment yeah okay, well, thank you Lucy thank you Lucy thank you. and once again uh, our thoughts are with Audrey and of course Thomas as well mm. Um, now here's Marty with the story of a rivalry that played out at Wembley Stadium but had nothing to do with a beautiful game mm -hmm.